Hey guys, we're here back with another episode of Factorio. And as you can tell from these guys flying around, I decided to build the logistic robots. And they are awesome. So uh, I'm, I'm using them too much now. <laughs> I gotta make some more, which is this. I'll go over them actually right now. Let me just make some more. I only have about... Uh, 15 no I don't okay so I have a huge huge network oh and uh, one reason why I built them is because we uh, researched a rocket silo and I need a ton of stuff for it and everything is everywhere so uh, that's why I have uh, these guys just so that I don't have to put all these conveyor belts all over the place. Okay, so um, the way it works is, as you can see, there's like a little orange area, and anything in the orange area is part of uh, the network. So that means they can access any one of these chests, and that line is basically network, and they'll connect all up to each other. And if I hover my mouse over here, I have negative one barrel. I don't know how that's possible. <laughs> I can see everything stored in my network. So, and then, uh, yeah, here's a requester chest. This one's requesting iron, and I have iron somewhere else being gathered up. Over here. So I'm gathering up iron here. And over here, I'm gathering up steel. Some of these, I, I'm gonna have to move this one. Because this one was actually starving uh, my production line. So I'll have to find another place to put it. Actually, maybe. Maybe down here might work best. Yeah. No, uh, I'm not not too much of a hurry, but yeah, maybe they'll work best. Um. So yeah, so I have like a whole bunch of requester chests, active chests. I'm not too sure the big difference between. Um. Okay, so there's the active provider chest. So. Rises constants to storages, requesters, construction, and player. Passive provider chests. It's basically the same thing except it doesn't do storage. Request chests. That basically says, hey, bring stuff to me. And storage. It's another one I'm not too sure on. I originally built them. It was for this. Now, another thing I am doing is this is the this is the original reason why I actually built the this logistic system. And after I built it, I'm like, oh, this is awesome. So I am actually stop in here, gathering the oil up here. Now. Uh, I want to cross to show you guys. Okay, I'll cross here. <laughs> Just to make sure. So what I'm doing here is I'm actually pumping oil into empty barrels. They're then being taken by the train and brought back here and they're processed all the way out over there. I might actually have to make another one. Maybe. Hmm. Well, while I'm here, let's see. Do I have any boilers on me? I, th I thought I did. The way to find out is just to hover. Yes, I have two. So I'll have to put one on there. One there, and then I'll get 
you and then you. Right? Yes. And then you and then you. Good. Put that there. These things are power hungry, those uh Um, those drones are so power hungry. Okay. Might have to be more pipes. I don't know. But yeah, it's, it's going well. Good. So yeah, so this is a smart one just saying hey take these out and this one puts anything in boop that's so fast no no okay so I'm gonna go up man and they are attacking me more and more Oops. No, no, no. I want to check my inventory and accidentally hit enter. Okay. Oh, actually, I just need some uh, plates. So then, over here, I'm actually taking out crude oil barrels. Here, I'm actually requesting the empty barrels. Now, these are actually going way over here. Oh. I don't know, I drove my tank down this way. I wish they could pick me up and just fly me around. I'll stop there. Are flying all the way over here. And they're being processed. And then they're coming down here. And I'm putting the empty barrels here. There it goes. And there's the empty barrels, and he just took it. So yeah, that's the entire process. And it's working out pretty well. Right now it's actually being stored up here. Instead of, well, actually, yeah, these things are still working. But yeah, I love these things. I gotta make some more. So now I can request stuff, but I don't know how long it actually takes because I have so many of these, like. They're doing so much stuff. Ah, he's chasing me! Come in, come in! <laughs> Will he always make sure I have some? Oh. Well, that is awesome. We don't have a lot in there. Where'd he go? Went. Yeah, so we have 15 in our network right now. But, oh, it is awesome. Oh, actually, you know what? This gives me a great idea of what to do. Um, oh, man, it's going to be hard. I'm thinking, because I'm, I'm running out of materials here and there. And I'm wondering how viable it is to build just a network of robots to transport stuff instead of a train. That would take a very long time. Right now, they only carry two at a time, two items. Yeah, it wouldn't be very efficient. Is 
should be safe. Because each one of these I can build a wall around and have some of them deliver ammunition to shoot. I don't know. You know what? I think I'm going to do one. Just one one base like that. Oh, thank you. <laughs> he chased me down. Oh, thank you. You're making sure I always have some. Uh, hmm. Would I be able to do that today? I don't know. Uh, one thing I'm worried about. One thing I am worried about right now is my iron. Oh, actually, you know what? Do I have to? What do I need here? I need a whole bunch of these things. Ah, uh, there is an actual iron patch not too far from us. That's actually within our walls that I haven't used yet. It's actually right up here in the minimap. Let's take that away. Um, hmm. So I'm going to active provider for it. And I have some drones. I'm going to give it to you. There you go. Oh, like I said, I love these things. It's very tiny. Uh, can I build one of these? I'll build one anyways. Okay. Now. Where did they go? Ah. Let's put you like that, like that, like that. That should cover everything. Good. See now, I want. Do I have enough? What am I missing? Can I request them? Is it in my network? Actually, I'm I'm out of my network area. Okay. There. Actually, not too far. And this. Oh, man. No. I want that. Gotcha. No, now I'm thinking I might just want to bring it all the way down here. Right now I'm gathering a whole bunch here. But if I if I put a requester here from over there, it's gonna grab it from this. Hmm. Yeah, 
yeah you know what I think I'm just gonna put just a couple of furnaces here let's see where There. Good. And then I'll put an inserter and another inserter. Provider. Oh no. Not you are uh, a smart one. Until you put that in. Good. And now what I need to do is I have to build another one of Bot places where they say this. So I need. All right, so I'm gonna gather the materials, and I'll be back, and we're gonna put it all the way over here. So, back in a moment. Okay, so there we go. Put that one there. There, and that's connected now to that. Good. And I guess I'll just put this in. There. And now, it's charging up. A lot of my robots are now just sitting down, not doing anything. There. Still not a hundred percent sure about the this thing. Cause those repair packs there is one with one of them, but hey, he's just not there. <laughs> okay. Now this is the area I was planning on actually making my rocket silo and all that. They keep turning this thing down. I need more defense. Might do a laser. Let's request stuff. So how much do I need for the laser? I need 20 electronic circuits. Gotcha. Bring them to me. I don't want to go out and get them. I know that they're only over there, but. <laughs> mm -hmm -hmm. Too bad I can't uh, suggest them make me stuff. Gotta make this too. This this is gonna take a while. It's hard to tell. Where are my robots? Those guys are for me. No oh, thanks for. It. You know what? You know what? There. There, I did it myself. And I can get an upgrade next, uh, which allows me to uh, 
send my items away. No, I had the radar originally there, but they keep destroying it. Now I have my gun. And then the radar, iron plates. Now, I'll, I'll do that after. <laughs> All right, well, anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. I love these guys. They have been doing so much for me. I like this, that I can just hover over this and see what's in my network. I'm going to play around more with the storage uh, stuff, because what I'd really like to do is have an area with a whole bunch of this stuff. And then, uh, yeah, so I can actually just have like kind of like a central location instead of all this stuff all over the place, like this. Like this is far. But I think I could do that with this. I'd have the requester and then have it go into the storage thing. That might work. Long term storage for the logistics system. Logistics system. Provides this content. Provides this kind of storage. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see. I'll play around with it a little bit more. Oh, it kind of requests a bit of everything, I think. Hold on. Before I go, let, let's just see. Let me put you right there. Now they all spread out. That is exactly what it does. Oh. Okay. Okay, that makes sense. And then I guess once I request something from the logistics system, then okay. Sweet! Hi! <laughs> Well, anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye! <laughs>